Hi there, it's Chris Jones here again from South Leisure Sales Director. What I've got today for you is a 2008 Willoughby, New Hampshire, 40 by 16 two bedroom lodge. Um, we'll take a look inside and explain a bit about it uh, and how it comes, what it can do for you. Um, outside wise, this is built to um, the Canexel finish, which is the Sierra colour, so you'll see this brown look. Uh, along with the brown Canexel, it's also got the golden oak window frames, matching sockets, facial boards, and brown gutters as well. As we step inside, you'll see where it offers. So the main reason for doing a video is so you can appreciate the size that this lodge actually is. When we split this lodge and put it in two halves, it's hard to actually appreciate the space or the feeling of space you get in a lodge of this size. Um, we often have on display our 20 foot wide lodges, but when it comes to 16 foot wide, it's quite an unknown entity. Not many people know about them and they even exist. Um, this to come in pre-owned is pretty rare. Um, it's available at the moment for us to sell uh, to, to own land or maybe even onto a holiday park. But, uh, but showing it as it is, hopefully will help you guys understand what you get for your money. So 16 foot wide, this comes in two eight foot halves. Literally, we split it down the middle once it's taken off site. Um, I'm six foot seven. I'm a big lad, so it's nice to be able to see and see the sort of height of the ceiling, the sort of height of the walls, the feeling of space that you get in this. As I say, it's super, extremely well looked after by the previous owner. Um, it's like one owner from you. Um, this isn't the original sofas that would have come with the lodge. However, they are in keeping still. They are leather, two electric recliners, and also a manual recliner as well. Um, but you've got this large, 16 foot wide, well, I'd say approximately 15 feet deep lounge area. TV points in the corner, lovely feature fireplace, sideboard, double glazed central heated of course, as you'd expect with this sort of standard. And lovely uh, slatted um, vertical blinds there with huge glass, so it gives a nice feeling of space and, and the light coming in, natural light. Kitchen area itself is lovely butcher block worktops. Plenty of uh, preparation space in the kitchen. You've got a large range master new world cooker. Um, you've got all soft closed drawers and covered fascias. Um, you've even got the loose appliance, which is a, a washer dryer down here. Slot for the microwave. It's superb. As you can see, there's plenty of room in this kitchen. Um, then you've got the American fridge freezer. So as you walked in the lodge on the right hand side, the American fridge freezer, um, which uh, will have the uh, drinks facility inside. It isn't plumbed in. It's one of those ones you have to add the water yourself but it's certainly superb size for trees. So this is the New Hampshire. So the Willoughby New Hampshire was first designed by Willoughby in 2006. Everyone thought they were mad to build lodges whenever or what they built for, for many years before was a caravan. And they got it right with the New Hampshire, in my personal opinion. I must have sold dozens of these over the last sort of 15, 16 years, but you do get a lot for your money. So Willoughby's standard, Willoughby's quality is to be seen in the sort of lodge you see. If you follow me through to the bedroom end, you have this carpeted uh, walkway through to two bedrooms. That's got two double bedrooms. So the first double bedroom we come into is through this door here. So double bed, bedside units either side, sockets of course for your lamps, etc. Nice feature headboards, uh, nice feature of, again, the vertical blind windows. Then you've got your TV point, little TV, this one for example, what you'd have. This day and age, you'd have probably a lot thinner, but a lot bigger TV, an LED one perhaps. Through to a walkthrough wardrobe, whereby great storing all your clothes either side, you know, quite a luxurious walkthrough wardrobe, through to the, the main bathroom. And the main bathroom is here, where you have the bath. It's not got a shower over it, but it wouldn't take much to change that for yourself to put a shower screen. So you have a bath and a shower in the one. Again, modern sink, the top bottom flush toilet, and a heated, a heated tower rail. So it's again, fantastic size lodge. Really deceptive and you can't appreciate it when it has been split in two, hence the reason for the video. Back out the door into the hallway. And what we've got is a Jack and Jill door situation here. You've got the door here, which could be the guest bedroom slash the guest bathroom. But that's Jack and Jill off the main uh, bedroom behind us here so as you turn around you'll see the uh, bed is again a double bed affording space either side for your drawers a lovely three drawer sorry three door uh, mirrored wardrobe vanity area and above us we've also got two twin v-lux windows 
which are just superb. You, you know, you've got a pole there to control the light coming through, opening and closing the actual windows themselves. But yet again, another TV point here. So it's all pre-wired. In the other bedroom we just saw in the wardrobe was actually um, the booster to be able to send the signal to all the rooms. So you've got TV in all bedrooms. And this is the Jack and Jill door through into the ensuite shower room, which as you can see is a fantastic size shower. Um, again, really ideal for what your needs are. So that's it. So it's a 2008 Willoughby, New Hampshire, 40 foot by 16 foot wide in Sierra Can XL. Again, very rare to have them in Sierra Can XL of that age. Um, any questions you've got, please, please give us a call um, or see the number at the bottom of the other video and we'll hopefully answer your questions you've got. Thank you.